the pranks between men and women need to cease and desist. I have had enough. This is not fun anymore. Anybody who follows my page knows that I've been in a prank war with my significant other for about the last two months. Now, this all started when she thought it'd be funny to grind up some damn avocados and put it in my toothpaste when she knows I hate that leprechaun jizz shit. Got it all in my toothpaste and shit. So then I, in return, decided to take some dough piss and put inside her Versace perfume. She didn't find that as funny as I did, but I laughed my ass off. So as retaliation to my prank, she decided to put skunk spray in my scent cover that I use when I go hunting, so she completely ruined the entire day of hunting. Now, in, in retaliation to that, I decided to grow a porn mustache, but after two weeks with no acetol, I decided to shave my damn mustache because I thought we'd grown up a little bit and not pranking each other no more. Was I wrong? Jesus Christ. Last night, I knew something fishy was going on when I came home and she already had dinner ready because normally we do the cooking together. Okay, but she knows that one of my favorite foods in this entire world is tacos, and last night was Taco Tuesday. So I come in, and she's got a whole spread out on the counter ready for Taco Tuesday. She's got, she shredded some cheese, she's got uh, chicken uh, tacos ready, fish tacos ready, beef tacos or deer tacos, whatever it was, ready. She's got all this on the counter. So I'm happy as a damn pig and slop, just eating my damn weight in tacos. Don't tell my trainer. But anyway, so I'm eating my damn weight in tacos. Now, anybody else? who knows me knows what tacos does to my stomach. Is it worth it? Absolutely right. So I did it anyway. Now, I woke up this morning at 4.30 to go to the gym like I do every morning. When I got there, the pre-workout that I drank happened to ignite some kind of chemical reaction with the tacos in my belly, which is I, I refer to gingerly as a gut buster, okay? But I'm one of them people that won't shit anywhere else except the house, so I had to rush back to the house after I got done working out in order to drop a stink pickle. Well, once I got there, which I do every morning, it's kind of a thing. I go straight to the commode, all right? I take my clothes off. I pop down on the commode. Now, this woman that I claim is mine has decided it is a good idea to completely coat the entire surface of the commode seat with Gorilla Glue. Here I am, naked as a jaybird, glued to the commode. And I don't know if any of y'all ever had Gorilla Glue on you, but the shit's so strong, it'll take your skin off. So I had to sit there naked by myself glued to a commode for an hour and muster up the courage one inch at a time to do some shit like this right here an inch at a time leave half of my ass on the seat i have a perfect ring of raw ass meat around my ass have you ever had raw ass meat on your ass and try to sit somewhere i've got gauze bass of tracing painkillers cream all kind of shit on there my ass is like the surface of the sun and she don't know it yet but retaliation is coming i ain't figured out what i'm gonna do yet but you bet your ass one thing darling it's coming shit